Welcome guys, welcome back. Today we will be playing, I'm going to be reviewing, as you can tell by the title, Project Flight. And please do not, and I've covered my face, so I don't have to worry about reflection. Anyway, so I might be, oh, yep, I'm actually using the website and plus that's really dark. I need to turn up. Wait, no, that's just me. It was fine, sorry, I have some glasses on. Due to me covering my face. So, in today, so today, as you can tell, we are reviewing Project Flight. I'm going to say if you actually want to buy it, and if you're thinking about it, here's just some advice and like a little, t a little bit of a taste of the game, just so if you if you're like if you have fifty robux or more, you can purchase this and you'll have it unlocked forever. Now, um, we are loading in. Oh, you can hear that music. Um. I'm going to mute that so I don't get copyrighted. Anyway, so we're loading in. Um, well, I'm only muting it because, yeah. So, as, as we load in, you can tell we have chat. Well, so the chat, and you, we, you, I mean, you kind of see that, but it's blue. Normally, when you type, your text will be white, like this can't see uh, you may no you can sorry just i have some on it's really hard to see um it's just because he's atc and it's 65 robux i think or 60 robux to purchase um atc so here's the latest update from the 31st of march this year obviously you've got the boeing triple seven three hundred er i actually own this game pass we have a new Piper PA46 M350, which is completely free. Uh, let's close that. And then we have three things. Right here. This one is not available. This is just so you can fly, and this is for ATC. Now, ATC is... I wouldn't, I wouldn't highly recommend getting it if you like difficulty with um, stuff like that. Then I would recommend that. But if you just want to fly, then click fly now, free flight, and then you can choose your your aircraft. Now the, they have three Airbuses and four Boeings. I would rather Boeing, like do Boeing, since I have a Game Pass in it. But I can only fly A320 and A220, not the A330, since that is a 95 robot Game Pass, same with the 787. But triple seven is 115 robux but it is good i would say it's one of the best aircrafts in the game it's and the, the i can't speak blah, blah. Um, these have really good models um but just so you get perspective that is the a320 just look at the lighting look at the gears and this thing has proper animations for the flaps spoilers engines gears and it also has like uh the tails so like when you're moving on the ground uh the tail things go up like the spoilers go up so you can turn the same with the tail but if you're thinking about purchasing this game i would start off with some of the free aircrafts uh and this game is really easy to get the hang of so uh just give it a bit to loads this is a big game this is the triple seven three hundred er now, there are other versions of the 777, but they aren't in the game yet. So, we have the... We can't see. There's a triple landing gear. Um, it's a Chuck Mumbles aircraft compared to the A320. But, just so you get a little bit of a taste, we're going to start with the A320. And I'm going to do one with the um, Boeing 777. Obviously, I'm just going to go with a classic Airbus, which I know is... Hold on. Uh, the, yeah, the second one. So I know, yep, Airbus. Uh. Now, there is a downside to the triple seven, and that is, uh, it, you can only spawn at like three airports. But with the smaller aircrafts like this, you can spawn at any airport. It does not matter which one. Um, so I'm just gonna spawn here and look at this, guys. Wow, I'm still so surprised. I've had this game for a bit. And honestly, this is amazing. The gra- like... Yeah, okay. I, I, oh, sorry, my game's lagging. It's, it's a high... It's a big game. 
hold on, give it a second. There we go. Whoa. Now, if you ever get stuck, there is a control thing here. And it shows you each of the controls. Let's turn on the engines. You can see over here the uh, starting to turn on. But if you do not know, like if you would rather prefer a free game and you want something that's quite easy to play, I would recommend PTFS. It's really easy to get the hang of. All you need to do is click controls. But I would recommend playing on computer. And by the way, um, <clears throat> Protect Flight is only available for PC or computer for now. So you need. So I would recommend a high-end computer. So let's just push back. And push backing doesn't. You don't have to wait until your engine started up. It's just I was talking and it's hard to concentrate. Um. So yeah. So, let's turn back. <laughs> what are y'all saying? LH454 requested. Texas. Ha! <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay. Let's turn for that. And there, then it has brakes. It has brakes. Now we got a Jet 2, a uh, triple. No, 737. Now let's just do a classic takeoff. Look at this taxiing, and this is what I was saying. Like the, like you can see. Oh, we crashed. You can see by the tail and the wings, kind of. Oh, I'm going really fast. Oh, that they are moving is because there's insane scripts in this game. It's amazing. Omg. Now. Obviously, I don't need the entire runway, but I just want to take off as good as possible. So now, uh, so we got a jet two being a bit of um, just being annoying. Oh, it's a Chan X. Wow. So let's get this thing to full throttle. Yeah, I could turn up the volume, I just forgot. Just listen to that. Wow. And you can fly a bunch of different airlines, like your favourite airlines, like, I don't know, like, EasyJet, if you're in Europe, or somewhere around there. Air Canada, American, United. Okay, look at that. Wow. This... It's amazing let's bring those flaps up let's put spoilers to flight um let's bring those gears up beautiful wow wow now obviously because i'm me we are going to immediately land at southampton southampton which is a small airport here, just so I can get this over with. Now, this, that you can scroll from 1 through to 9. Um, with these. Now, I just... Oh, yeah, we have V1 Rotate. So, Rotate. Sorry about that from Swiss. Oh, I'm going a bit slow. I'm spinning, I'm spinning, I'm spinning, I'm spinning. And this thing actually does have rudder. I'm using it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm going slow again. 100 above. 100 above. <laughs> I'm so funny. Uh, I might not be. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. Okay, this is a very unstable approach. Still new to this. Okay, that was good. 91 feet per minute. Okay, let's turn on that. Full spoilers. Come on. <laughs> Bring that over there. Okay. Okay. We are good. Um beautiful stop with that. Okay. Now what we can do is now we are going to spawn the triple seven three hundred ER, which is the biggest 
aircraft in the game, I think. Definitely not in the world. It's really a much bigger aircraft, but it's not in the game, unfortunately. Yeah. I mean, it's not even in the first stage of development. It's pre-alpha. And alpha's the first stage. And it's early access. So if you want to be an OG with me, then feel free. Okay, so we've got a bunch of different airlines to choose from. Um... American since you know anyway so as you can see you we see an orange text you can oh you cannot see that but it says on Kintala hold on Katila yep it says too small for current air law, aircraft same with TVAP Southampton and Bo Bo Vista. I can only spawn this aircraft at London Gatwick Menorca or Gran Canaria I'm gonna fly from London Gatwick to Grand Canaria. So let's just spawn it to a four. I like spawning at this gate, please don't question. Spawn. And just look. Look at how big this aircraft is. This is 115 Robux. And I spent my money on this. I spent my money on the Robux, obviously. I'm not like a two-year-old who needs their mom to purchase the Robux so they can spend on on that on clothes that they think they're gonna get in real life. Sorry, I'm roasting people. Oh, whoopsies! I hit the tripod. Well, man, it's mainly my phone that I hit, but okay. So we're American two nine three two. Let's turn that off. Let's put the speed brakes. Uh, so we're one engine done. Oh, let's just wait until the second engine starts. And I also found this. So I'm getting off side tracks. But listen to that. Well, why don't you wait for those engines? Beautiful. Now okay, let's get it in. And let's say in the chat V1 rotate. Rotate. Sorry, I love this one. Such a sad for noise. Anyway, I'm getting sidetracked. We don't care about that. I care about is making entertaining videos for my viewers. And also thank you so much for 51 no 51? 56 subscribers. Uh, I will do a special at at 60 with me covering me ranking every single plane in PTFS. There's 81 aircraft that I have to review in that. Oh my gosh, it's gonna be an hour long video. But please subscribe if you wanna see that. And join the 60 gang. <laughs> oh, well, I'm gonna regret that. But I make promises and I keep them. No. Also, I think I gained like 20 subscribers in like two weeks, no, like a week or something. That's amazing, so incredible progress. Well, that was like four months ago though. That was when I was doing the Pikmin walkthrough. That's when I first got, like when I was just starting doing Pikmin content. And you guys absolutely adored that. You gave me uh, 3,000 views. Now what's happening with the throttle? Okay, it's a bit weird, ain't it? Oh, I need to put flaps. Okay, yeah, the thruster was kind of just given up. It's mainly with this aircraft for some reason. Oh, V1 rotate. I say that in chat. V1 rotate. We're already going like 200 knots. Oh, wow. Okay, flaps up, let's put this gears up as well. So, what has this come to? It has come to the autopilot system. This thing has an entire autopilot system. Heading to 11, speed. Boom, boom, boom. So now I don't even have to do anything. 
for this. I, I literally can just sit here and do nothing. It It's doing it for me. It literally just flies for me. So it's getting me back down to the 2500. So if we go to 2800. And also, guys, go check out my new video. Well, the day old. Oh, sorry. Um, but it's me loading Nerf guns. It's uh, my source of Nerf, and I wanted to make a video out of it. <laughs> um, so, because I don't think you guys want to see me just doing absolutely nothing, waiting to get to Grand Canaria. Hold on, let me control the speed. Well, time lapse. Okay, we're back, and we're approaching. Get the throttle all the way down. Flaps. Okay. We are approaching Grand Canaria. Let's put the bit down. And if you want to have a failure, click menu, click the exclamation mark, and choose your failure. Okay, so you're approaching, and please don't mind the back noise. Anyway, so it's coming in. Uh, oh, dog, oh gosh, hold on. Okay, sorry, my dog. I didn't want my dog to bark on camera. Um, now, why am I so high up? I don't understand. 3,000 feet up. I should be like 2,000, like 100. 1500 feet, not not 2700. <laughs> Apparently, this goes money in water. Um, as you can tell, the chat. Okay, so we just did that upside down. Okay. So, uh, let's find the runway and let's try to butter since I'm not good with total landing gears. Well, that's mainly in PTFS. Right, you can see this gear is just like you can see the wheels like attach and they're moving due to me going at 100 dots, and that's not that's not fast enough so I need to I thought a bit um twelve hundred feet so good height okay I'm way off center I'm, I, I'm so I'm so off center Yes, 10 out of 10 approach at 135 knots. Okay, let's just smash this in. How was that a good landing? I've got to set my flaps. Okay, I'm on the taxiway. Now, comes to the question, should you buy this game? Okay, it'll bring me to the app by the way. Should you buy Project Flight for 50 Robux? I would say yes. If you love realistic flight simulators, then I would say yes. If you don't have enough Robux, I would definitely recommend Pilot Train Flight Simulator. Um, where is it? This which I had uh, updates. Just want to show you it before I end the video. But please like, subscribe, turn on notifications so you don't miss out on videos like this. Please, please subscribe. I'm trying to get 60 subscribers as I said earlier in the video. 
and I will review every single aircraft in this game. And I'm loading it. So. Yeah, so as I said, I would definitely recommend this game if you don't have enough Robux for, um, you know, Project Flight. Now, it hasn't loaded in, but there's two tunnels in Greater Rockford and St. Bartholomew. New, two new badges, and a Top Gun mission at Tokyo International at Orangey, and a three stadiums for flyovers, an updated Hawk T1 cockpit and Red Arrow's tail, updated UH-60 cockpit, reduced rain probability, and a few bug fixes. Um, but... Let's look at the shop. I have most of these. So I have the Airbus A380, it's in for him, uh, SR-71, and I have all of this, this entire row, in the second row, I have all of that. I have F-35, Blue Angels, Red Arrows, Lidget, Alpha Bigger, Super and Access, and that's all. And I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Goodbye.